To Wade. Let's it go for two. And that's his sixth rebound of the game. Looking to curl in. Smart. Good finish inside. Lowry running the team. Wade's looking for the screen to get himself open. He curls with the runner. Soft touch gets the roll. You're not going to see a better possession in the NBA from both sides of the ball. Good defense. Good offense, good offense, one out that time. He's blocked. Ten seconds to go on the shot clock. Curling in to the rim. Flips it up and it rolls in. It's hard to guard NBA-level athletes who can also handle the ball. Here, using his dribble drive opportunity, gets in the paint and finishes right at the rim with strength. 11 seconds remaining on the 24. Final seconds counting down for three with one on the clock. Won't go from outside the arc. And now he moves around the defender. Misses on the bank shot. Luck is not a defensive plan. They allowed the ball into the paint and were very fortunate that they didn't knock that shot in. To Smart. Goes for the three-pointer. Able to connect, and it's now a double-figure lead. Top of the key three, money. Lowry's using the screen, looking to get free. 11 seconds now on the shot clock. Nice move into the paint. Fires for two. And Al Horford with his seventh rebound. Right now, he owns the paint, getting every rebound in sight. Gallinari hits again, back-to-back -back threes. And they need a timeout here. It's called. Good timeout taken here. The opposing team's coming on a run. You get your team focused at the timeout. Tell them, we're at home. We need to finish this off in a close game in the second half. The Heat get the inbound in here. We're down to 11 seconds on the shot clock. Goes to the goal. Miami's eight for nine from the line. And here's the replay with another look at that great finish at the rim. Completes the three-point play. Feeds it right back. There's the switch. To the basket, flips it up. The Celtics with the offensive rebound for another possession.
It's a loose ball. Comes up with a pretty steal. To Wade. Pretty fake. Fools the defense. Wade for two. Shoots away. Off the mark. Great luck. Puts it home with a slam. Good defense translates into good offense. Here, secure the rebound, finish your defensive possession, and then get out and go. Take the ball to the basket, get an easy opportunity, reward your hard work on defense. Won't go for three. This guy's a great shooter. They were on him like Velcro and forced to miss. Good defense. To the rim. And he gets to go back to the free throw line. Couple of more free throws. Oh, he got hit, and they call it. Draws the foul, called against Whiteside. Number 45 to the line. And he hits the first free throw. Able to convert on both free throws. Boy, they need to get something going here. Screen set nicely. Still plenty of time, 12 seconds on the shot clock. And he kicks it out. Finds the space and takes the wide open three. Miami's in need of a big-time defensive stop here. Gallinari's trying to get free off the pick. And he curls in. Horford fires away for two. Gets it to go. And it's a 14-point lead for Boston. That's a 14-6 run for the Celtics. Here's the screen. He's feeling hot. Tries another three-pointer. And Al Horford with his ninth rebound. Smart down into the lane. He got a piece of it. Out of bounds, turnover. And the Celtics making a change. And Danilo Gallinari will be the man for the inbound. to Horford. You're going to have to be quick with this shot. What a rejection. Gets it right back. Shot blocked by Horford. This is one of the great defensive performances I've seen in a while. The number of shot blocks in really rain shot blocks where he's coming from a long ways away to challenge shots at the basket and right on the block tremendous effort gets it and quickly shoots that three that one in and out hey when you're going up against the great shooters in this league you need to combat that with tenacity and passion tremendous defensive possession forcing the miss against one of the great shooters in our league Wide open. Puts it in. That's a long two-pointer. That's just big-time offensive basketball in the NBA. Searching the open man out, hitting him on time and on target, and then finally capitalizing by making the shot. Butler on the drive. Oh, rejected. To Horford. Eleven seconds remaining on the 24. He goes baseline. Smarts looking to post up down low. To Horford. Curls in. Throws it down the rim. Hey, can you say blowout? Is it going to change? Not with this defense. Lowry's using the screen, trying to get free.
He dishes it. Gets to the rim. Brogdon the rebound. Smart. Has no place to go. Gallinari for two. And the rebound taken by Butler. Gets inside. Shoots for three. Knocks down the three-pointer off a quick release. All kinds of confidence on that three-pointer. Great looking shot. Entry pass gets it inside. Gallinari. It's a loose ball, and they come up with a turnover. Inside, lays it in. And we'll have a timeout. The Celtics up by 13. I really like what I saw on this possession. Active, aggressive defense. And then don't pull the ball back out and run offense. Attack the basket. They did, and they were rewarded with an easy opportunity at the rim. Personnel changes for both sides right now. To Horford, looking to dominate down low. Horford for two, lets it go. And they bring it up. Need to stop the bleeding here. To Barnes. Sets up the J nicely with the step back. Won't go the two-pointer. You gotta figure out how you can get a better quality shot and use your greatness to attract the second defender and find the open man. Horford fires, gets the two, lucky roll. Lowry running the offense. Oh, excellent screen. Oh, quick move, gets inside. Lowry shot thrown right back at him. 11 seconds now on the shot clock. Gets in the paint. He tries to step back. Touch there, not this time. Defend, defend, defend. Never give in. Good contest, good closeout. This is the type of defense that they must play. Gallinari. Boston's eight for eight from the line tonight. He says no, but the ref says foul. Called against Barnes. It's hard to score in this league, but you have a better chance if you're a great free throw shooter to do it at the free throw line. This is good basketball right here. Be aggressive, take the contact, and get to the free throw line. Goes two for two at the line. Moves around the defender to Lowry. Olinix trying to get down low. Barnes against Scalinari. Bosch forces it up. Defense all over him. Bradley the rebound. Quick feedback. Bradley for two. Ooh, misses the inside shot. Hey, that's a tough shot, but I'd rather have a good player taking a bad shot than a bad player taking a good shot. Quick release for three. Three-pointer won't go. It's all about making your teammates better. And the way you make them better is to give up a good shot to try to create a great shot. To Gallinari. 
We're down to nine seconds on the shot clock. Bradley, wide open for two. That's good. He's shooting 75% from the field. Hey, they have just gotten steamrolled here tonight. This offensive execution has been fantastic. The defensive intensity, not good enough to stop this offensive juggernaut. To Barnes. Oh, it's turned back by Gallinari. Miami's got to be aware of how badly they need a stop. Just a matter of can they do it. Bosch. Excellent ball movement around the perimeter. And Kyle Lowry with a nice look from three-point range. That's a thing of beauty right there. The three-point shot, nothing but net. To Gallinari. Here's the pick. Continue to work it around the perimeter. Looking to curl in. Misses at the rim. Hey, that's how they created the lead. They got the ball to the rim. They just missed that one. On the run with the floater. Can't get it to go from close range. Some might question that shot right there. I like that shot. You have a great player who's a great shooter. I like the creativity. He just missed it. That pass picked off by Horford. Shoots the three. Puts it in. At the buzzer. And that will end the third quarter. The Heat down by 21. Stay with us for more NBA on ESPN after this short break. Jeff, big lead as we start the fourth quarter. What's the key to wrapping this up quickly? Continue to breathe. This other team is a joke. They're showing no signs of life. All you got to do is go out there and go through the motions. My goodness. Horford shoots it for two. Knocks down the shot. The Celtics up by 23. And as this game has gone on and progressed, they have become more and more efficient offensively here in the second half absolutely dynamic offense defense has to switch makes his move that's enough unable to bank it in hey it's been one of those nights where nothing's been easy for them in the paint terrific team de reaches in taken away by Horford Brogdon soft touch the banker time and time again Penetration at the basket, good finish. That is why they're blowing this team right out of the building. Screen set nicely. From beyond the arc, knocks down the three-pointer. Miami's shooting 47% from downtown tonight. Nice quick decision right there. Three points straight on. To Brogdon. Aaron pass, and he takes it off the head. To Lowry. Blocked by Horford. And he has just been a defensive force in this game. Shot block after shot block after shot block. The Celtics with the offensive rebound for a new 24. Bradley misses again. Barnes setting up the play. Quick move to get inside. The runner, in and out. Two minutes gone by in the fourth. Miami's down by 22. Gallinari's looking to do damage in the paint. We're down to 11 seconds on the shot clock. To Horford. Puts it up for two. Barnes, the rebound. To Barnes. 
Lowry's looking to get free off the screen. On a catch and shoot. It's good. That'll be a two-pointer. That's good defense, better offense, a nice contested two-point shot. To Gallinari. Shot is blocked. Decides to pass. Gallinari fires it up again. It's good. A two-pointer. Danilo Gallinari shooting 60% from the field in tonight's game. That's beautiful basketball right there. Getting a two-point shot. Look at that balance, rhythm, and follow through. Ball comes loose. Oh, he loses it. A little personnel change going on right now. Eleven seconds remaining on the twenty four. He curls, creates some space with that step back, and Dwayne Wade with a nice play. Three and a half gone by in the fourth. Miami's down by 20. It's picked off. Sloppy play. To Bradley. Oh, excellent screen. Into the paint. Nice adjustment. Getting it done. Now that's how you clean up a miss. Great dunk on the putback. That's a poster right there. What a hammer dunk. The shot clock down to 12 seconds remaining. Nice fake. The layup just rolls in off the rim. Look, you can't give up layups like that. You got to protect the basket and the paint at all costs. To Horford. For two. Unable to flip it in. This guy's a great shooter. They were on him like Velcro and forced the miss. Good defense. Shot clock says 12. No doubt about it. Whistle blows a foul called against the Celtics. That's their first team foul. Both coaches now feeling they need to make some changes on the floor. Passes it back to him. To the rim. Off the glass. Oh, what a pass from Kyle Lowry. Beautiful concentration there to finish over the top of the defender without worrying about being fouled. To Horford. Right back, curling in to the basket. Can't connect from close range to Wade. It's a loose ball. Kicks it back out. Larkin jump shot. Wade the rebound. Trying to take it all the way. Wade for two. Puts it up. His jump shot won't go. Hey, when you're going up against the great shooters in this league, you need to combat that with tenacity and passion. Tremendous defensive possession, forcing the miss against one of the great shooters in our league. To Lowry. Fires away for two. And Al Horford with his 12th rebound. For the layup. Won't go. Misses on the banker. Good offense once again. Got the ball into the paint and to the basket. Just missed it. Screen set nicely. Nice move into the paint. White side shot swatted away. A 
good solid entry pass. Puts it up. Gets it to go. Excellent teamwork on that play. To Lowry. Puts it up from three-point land. And the rebound grabbed by Horford. Larkin just won't go from point-blank range. Butler on the drive, fires away for two, and a nice finish at the basket. There's the pick, and now he moves around the defender, puts it in, plus the foul. Chance at a three-point play now with the free throw coming up. Great concentration to finish the play and get the three-point play opportunity. Can't connect on the free throw. Setting it up for the isolation. Wade's looking for the screen to get himself open. Trying to work it down low. Let's it go. Ooh, misses the inside shot. At the rim, it's up and gets the roll. Sometimes the simplest plays are the hardest ones to execute. Good layup. And Miami calls a timeout. They need to stop the bleeding right now. Some substitution is going to be made now for the team. Ball comes loose, and they turn it over. To Smart. Down into the lane. Help defense there with the switch. Wow, is he open for the shot. Smart shot off the mark. And he curls in off the runner, misses at the rim. In the paint, able to put it in. He's shooting 62% from the field here tonight. If you can't get your defense back and set and make them play in a half court, you're going to be in big trouble. Here, once again, exploited in transition, right at the basket. You're not winning with that type of defense. And Luol Dang with the nice play, sinking the three. Made the most of his opportunity, and he knocked it in. Three ball. To the rim. Horford's rejected. Left-handed. Nice touch. Banks it home. Oh, excellent screen. He loses control of it. Here's a steal. Oh, a thunderous slam. When you're playing with a big lead, your players cannot take possessions off. And I like the example that this unit is showing. Forcing a turnover and then not resting, not conserving energy, pushing the ball and getting a transition opportunity. Unable to convert the three. Miami's now back on defense. They need a big stop to turn things around. And gets it to go. Good defense turning into good offense here. Finishing a defensive possession with a rebound and then pushing the ball in transition 
that leads to a basket to keep and extend the lead. Nice little fake, and he shoots. Oh, there's that Euro step move. Pretty. Looks to the post. Tries it again. Oh, he swats it. Getting to the basket. A pretty Euro step. Makes the adjustment and banks it in. You need guys who can beat their man off the dribble and finish at the basket. The Celtics with the ball here to Bradley. No, oh, he shoots it. That's good for two. The Celtics up by 27. That's a 14 to 5 run for the Celtics. To Dang. Gets it off. That's a two pointer. They get it back for an offensive rebound. Can't get it to go from close range. To Horford. Gets inside. And back outside. Keeps the man in front of him. Shot clock says one. Puts it up from downtown. First free throw, perfect. And Al Horford with 24 points. And Miami's got to be disappointed with how this game turned out. Tough loss for them here today. and our entire EA Sports crew. This is Mike Breen saying thanks for watching and good night. Raymond Rose here, and I've got your EA Sports post-game wrap-up. The Celtics were solid in today's victory. And what more could you say about their excellent field goal percentage? These guys couldn't miss even if they tried. Here are the guys who put up the most points for the Boston Celtics. The Heat didn't lose big, but it wasn't exactly close either. I'm sure they can't help but feel frustrated with the result, but they can't let that feeling linger. Sooner than later, they need to start thinking about the next matchup. Game track. Second chance points. The Boston Celtics looked very impressive today, especially when it came to capitalizing on their own missed shots. The way they kept extending possessions wore out the deep and earned them the win. Here's a look at the game stats. Player of the game. Al Horford could not have been better defensively. The way he blocked shots and stole the ball today is what makes for an all-NBA defensive first-team player. We have picked them for you. Here are the top plays. Number two. Number one. On behalf of ESPN on EA Sports, 
I'm Jalen Rose. We look forward to seeing you again next time.